Given what's happened in the US recently, it's obvious that Donald Trump is a self-centered, lemon-sucking, biological flamethrower impersonating my way or no way merchant who appears to have a pea-sized cauliflower brain, the comprehension skills of a freshly chewed wasp, and an ego the size of a solar system. In my opinion, he needs to be landed on hard enough to make a ton of bricks seem so much like a feather that his head spins, his teeth rattle, his feet don't touch the floor, and he feels like he's been booted into the middle of next week and broken into pieces so small the worms won't need to chew. Of course, that could also apply to Marjorie Taylor Greene. Now, I don't know what the inhabitants of Georgia's 40th Congressional District did to deserve her as a representative, but it must have been pretty bad. Which brings me to Alina Hubber. How did she even qualify as a lawyer? If I didn't know better, I'd think they had a quota to fill the year she graduated. Honestly, as far as I can tell, these three are so brainlessly dead from the mouth up that entering their skulls will be like visiting an echo chamber.